Uh, the problem with electric vehicles at the moment is that the batteries aren't quite as good as their combustion engine counterparts. So we have to improve batteries, we have to make sure that we can get more energy into every battery, we have to make sure that we can get them as efficient as possible, get every joule of energy out of those batteries to make them live as long as the cars live. Battery packs are made up of two main elements, the cells themselves and then the brain or the battery management system that controls the cells. Uh, Christoph was looking at the degradation of the cells themselves and found that there's a significant difference in how long cells will last. He went to the bin, opened some up and found that half of the cells in each pack are still useful and that they still have up to half of their energy remaining in them. At Brillpower we've developed battery control and management technology that can make lithium-ion batteries live for up to 60% longer. And we do that by individually managing every cell in a battery pack without having to replace the entire battery. We can just replace individual modules. What we need at this point in time is, is more information. So we know a lot about the inside of our battery pack, but we need to learn more about how batteries are being used in the real world. For that, we also need partners who are in the automotive sector and who use electric vehicles and their batteries. So in response to the Faraday battery challenge, we've teamed up with eCar in order to look at the feasibility of applying our technology to a fleet of electric vehicles. So eCar knows a lot about electric vehicles, their charging, their usage, and this has a big impact on how well the battery performs. So the Faraday battery challenge is really addressed at making the UK become a leader in battery production, battery design and usage. And we have a big idea that we think can disrupt a big market. Thank you.